When doing simple embedding, fold the elastic band around the corners. The bedding sheet must be inserted between the rescue sheet and mattress. Inform the patient along the process about what is happening. Then lower the bed to the bottom position, fasten the velcro straps around the patient. This will firmly secure the patient during evacuation. Please note that the velcro straps attach very easily. Generally, fire is possibly the worst thing that can happen to us, but especially when occurring in a care unit. While waiting for rescue, the staff have only a few minutes to move as many patients as possible to the gathering point. Inform the patient along the process about what is happening. Then lower the bed to the bottom position, fasten the velcro straps around the patient. This will firmly secure the patient during evacuation. Please note that the velcro straps attach very easily. Grasp both drawstrings at the foot of the bed and turn the mattress around 90 degrees. Then slide the patient down onto the floor and pull the patient across the floor to the gathering point. Remember to keep the back as straight as possible when pulling the patient. Throughout the evacuation process, patients should be pulled with the feet first, both when on floors and when going downstairs. Several studies have shown that with this new method of evacuation, the chances of causing injury to the patient are very low. The evacuation process performed is both faster and safer. The method is also much less physically demanding for the nursing staff.